Hey, welcome to the C floor plan. This is Lake Town unit 1205. It is one of their model units, so of course it's going to be a little bit nicer. Um, it hasn't been used. Um, it was rented at one time long term, but they've since had it as a model. So this is roughly the size of what all of your bedrooms are going to be. So this one is a five style type. So you'll know that 105 will have that same design as this does. And the furniture packages, um, 109 or 105 rather, it's listed at 139, I believe. It does have a rental in there, and I'm not sure when the rental, um, when he or she departs, um, or what it looks like. But the view isn't going to be the same. But I want you to get an idea of what the floor plan is. So, um, pretty cool ensuite. All of it granite, beautiful countertops. This is such a magnificent resort. It's got so much to offer. Very spacious. I would say for the price, this is probably one of the biggest condos that you would get um, on the Gulf with as many of the upgrades. One thing I really like about that you won't see in some of the other condos um, is the wide hallways. A lot of times when you come in here with suitcases, bags, and everything, a lot your walls will get damaged. Um, but here it's less likely as the it doesn't seem so claustrophobic so and granted it is a pretty big facility uh, So here is the bunk area. I've seen this turned into um, Single beds bunks are gonna get you the most return for your money um, I've also seen this made into an office So there are a lot of options for this most of these will come with bunks always recommend having a set of bunks that's how you get to that $20,000 uh, return for rentals. So there's that. Oh, and this is your HVAC closet. That's what they're all gonna look like. So there's that bit. Usually the guys wanna see that. The closet has an additional, or pardon me, <laughs> the uh, hallway has an additional closet. Yeah, so you do this for a living. You'd think I'd be better at it by now. But, um, so this is the five view. And what I wanted to try and explain and sort of put into um, perspective is this particular view is starting on the um, left golf facing side. So the numbers go from one to, I believe, 15 where it stops on this side and you really have to be able to get a golf view if that's something that you're interested in what you're going to have to be is so one let's start down here on this end here you're going to have to be 10 floors up for a decent golf view like this so we're on the 12th and that is sunbird condominium so once you move over to around seven or nine your golf view is going to be really blocked by sunbird unless you're over I'd say maybe the 15th floor so that's when you really get to see uh, the golf then so all of the views are you know hit and miss it just depends and obviously they add a premium to that there's the parking um, that's the main lobby entrance right there and again that's the golf uh, access point for everybody these are residential houses and of course that is a public access so you could utilize that access point here's the kiddie pool all right look how big these balconies that's another thing i wanted to show you as far as balcony space goes you really could have everybody out here um i've seen a table it was an eight seater and two lounges on one of these before so it's definitely a possibility um let me get in here and show you basically what the 05, that 105 would look like. So this is basically the floor plan and the setup for the kitchen. Later, should you want to do upgrades such as granite countertop, or not granite countertops, the uh, stainless steel rather, um, appliances, you could do that. And that would really, you know, kind of change the feel. Right now, the white, they're not bad, but that's just um, typical. Can't open it. Okay closing the door furniture packages I'm not sure if I touched on this but furniture packages are an additional five thousand dollars there are two main furniture packages this is um, 
one that I really like, but the secondary, if I'm not quite mistaken, it's uh, blues, a lot more blues, and it's super pretty. Um, and maybe I can get into another one of these units and show you. So this is the furniture package. It's um, from Tuskers. Let's see if they've got, oh, they don't have anything on the back there. But it's, that's the quality furniture that they're offering which I'm glad that they went that way and didn't cheap out. If you were to buy all this, including, you know, these accessories, it's going to probably run you, not probably, definitely run you at least $15,000 for something that they're um, offering at five. So let's see. Some of those price points that you'll see online will include um, furniture altogether. And excuse me if I'm talking a lot. I've, I've been running from unit to unit. So again... Just leave you with that beautiful view and I'll try and get a picture of the exterior of 105 and then where the 15 location is I'll stand outside of 415 and the 36 um, I'll also do that but I do want to let you know we have a multitude of options let me see if I can okay so see this spreadsheet here all of these units that are green on this grid are not on the market but are technically on the market so what you may not see is technically available uh, to the public so I obtained a copy of this and what we want to do is kind of focus our efforts on floor plans so this if you can see is one bed two bunk or sorry two bathroom rather and it's the C unit style type and then we see here what numbers are available so and then we have the a oh we don't want that one c okay well i'm gonna really have to look at this and investigate it but we will figure this out together and i'm here every step of the way to help you out and we can basically get down to the business and figure out what's really going to be the best view for you. Thank you.